Hi there. So today I've managed to download the Water Activities Day at Home Pack from our website gscouts.org.uk forward slash water activities and today I'm going to be showing you how to do challenge nine soccer splash and you'll find all of the instructions are in the page just here. So let's see how to do it. So the first thing to do is to make your soccer splash pitch. To do this, you'll need some straws. I've got some bendy ones here. If you haven't got bendy ones, straight one, which you can bend, will be just as good. You'll need some sticky tape. I've got some scissors to cut my sticky tape as well. If you need scissors, do ask an adult to help you. And I've also got an old tray. So this is an old baking tray that we use, but we don't need it at the moment. Later on, we'll need some other things to actually play the game. I'll show you those shortly. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take the tape and we're going to use the tape and the straws to make some goals. What you do is you put your two straws together like that so the legs are pointing downwards or if you're having to bend them that's okay. And what I'm going to do is just stick them together like that. Just a little bit of tape around there stuck together like that and that's one goal. Once I've done that I can then stick it to the end of my pitch like that. So a bit of tape on one leg and a bit of tape on the other leg. We've got one goal. And you do the same at the other end as well. So I've got my straws, I bend the ends down a bit, I stick it together with a little bit of tape like that and then in exactly the same way at the opposite end I put the legs in and I sellotape or tape those to the tray like that. And I stick that on the tray like that. And now we've got two goals. So we've got our two goals. You don't have to, but you might want to decorate your pitch to make it look a little bit more like a soccer pitch. So I've got a line going across the middle here for the halfway line. You can see that. And then what I can do is I could mark out some penalty areas, a bit like this. So I'm just going to put some bits of tape in. You don't have to do this, but if you want to make it look a little bit more like a pitch, you can do so. I've got another bit of tape for the penalty area. And I've got two more lines at that end. It's not very straight, but it's okay. Another line at that end and another bit for the penalty area. You have your pitch and that's part one now it's time to find a family friend or a member of your family to help you play the game so I've come outside to play the game now you don't have to but if you do do it inside just be aware that you might get a little bit of water spillage on your floor just be careful so to play the game you'll need two things you'll need two straws, one for each person, and you'll need a ball. And of course, it being Water Activities Day, you're going to need some water as well. So I've got a jug of water here, and I saved this from when we were doing Challenge 8, which is Splash of Magic. So I'm gonna pour this carefully into my tray. And the idea of this is to make the ping pong ball float. If you haven't got a ping pong ball, find another ball that might float instead. So I've got my pitch. I've got my straws and we have one to my other player. Hello. Hi. And we've got a ball and the idea is the first person to score a goal. So let's have a go. Yay! Yay! Well done. And that is Soccer Splash. It's Adam, your ACC Activities here. It's fantastic you're taking part in the Water Activities Day at Home. But here is a reminder of some of the water activities that we can provide for you when we get back to face-to-face -face scouting. We have bell boating, canoeing, canyoning, co-steering, sailing, kayaking, keel boating, scuba diving, raft building, pulling, and stand-up paddle boarding. And you know what? We've got many, many more. Don't forget to look up scouts.org.uk forward slash a to z have fun everyone